Another of the children lost in the Sandy Hook tragedy being remembered this day with the groundbreaking of a very special playground in West Haven. News Ace Brian Spiros has the details. Construction on playground number 24 is officially underway in West Haven. It's all part of the Where Angels Play project, which pays tribute to the lives lost in Newtown. It, it means so much to be part of this. Brian Hasselfelt came all the way from Canada to volunteer his time on today's playground, which honors six-year-old Charlotte Bacon. It's very hard to put into words on how, how heartfelt and what it really means to be part of this. The playground is located at Sea Bluff Beach. Originally, the plan was to put it at Oak Street Beach, but some had a problem with that. The location wasn't right for some people. That, that area the, is controlled by the land trust in the city of West Haven, and, and it bars development. You know, they thought this was the beginning of development. In the end, it all worked out. Charlotte's playground is slated to be finished on Sunday. It's designed to represent her young life. The overall theme is the color pink. She was addicted to the color pink, according to her mom. Uh, poodles, dogs, uh, her artwork is going to be recreated in vinyl. Charlotte's family and many others gathered in the rain today to take part in the groundbreaking. Let's get to work. This project celebrates who they were. This celebrates Charlotte's personality. Doesn't necessarily represent the day or the event, but represents her life. The final playground will be dedicated in September in Watertown. That one will be in memory of Sandy Hook Elementary School principal Dawn Hoxsprung. Reporting from West Haven, Brian Spiros, News 8.